Hey, hey, good morning to all of you. Thanks for stopping by and joining me on this Friday morning, May 19th. Uh, big thank you for all the, the emails I continue to receive, the support. It's, it's awesome. And, uh, you know, I say it all the time. I enjoy doing the blog videos, but hopefully it's a, it's a little bit of uh, insight into this uh, great hobby of ours. Uh, yeah, I got a little color. Brian, myself, and Ken snuck out yesterday morning for a round of golf. Uh, 94 degrees when we got off the course yesterday. And uh, the last two days, blistering hot. But today, we're back to the high is going to be 70. So this is, this is Vermont in spring. It can be one extreme. It was snowing last week, but we had 94 the last couple of days. So um, I've got to make this kind of short and sweet today. Uh, track day tomorrow down in uh, Palmer, Mass. Uh, fairly new track. Only been open a couple, uh, couple of years, but beautiful layout. Silky smooth. So I'm going to be uh, shooting some, uh, some, on, some onboard uh, video for sure. I'll be posting that up to the blog. Um, a bit of a, a downer. I got to throw a, a quick one out. Thoughts and prayers go out to the family of uh, Nikki Hayden. Uh, MotoGP champion, uh, crazy, crazy accident. He was in Italy training on his bicycle and he was hit by a car. And I just read yesterday that he's in a, a medically induced coma and, you know, he's in, he's in tough shape. Let's go with that. So, you know, thoughts and prayers go out to the Hayden family. Uh, just, uh, I'm a, you know, motorcycle guy. I follow that stuff and uh, shout out to Dan uh, Fialo for hooking me up with the, the uh, early info on that. So uh, let's let's keep our uh, keep our thoughts and prayers out for Nikki. Okay, uh, last week I threw a quick little plug in there, but not many of you picked up on it because our our uh, our regular sale is done. It's over. Okay, uh, because we got a, we got a ton of new product this week. But you guys that are smart and you picked up on it. You're saving big, and I'm going to throw it out there. Okay. A bunch of brands that we've been thinning out and uh, we've been over the last probably four or five, six weeks. Um, Spark, okay, this is all new old stock, the 43rds, $49.99 guys, that they're regularly 80 bucks, okay. The, the 118s, $129.99. Brum is down to $12. Ixo, $12.50. Best Art, $19.99. I mean, just make sure you get, if you get our weekly email, you're going to see links to each category this week, but make sure you're checking those out, scour through those categories, still a ton of the A1 condition models to be had for pennies on the dollar, I call it, okay, <laughs> but make sure you're checking that out. If you don't receive our weekly email, just go to the homepage at replicars.com, upper left, there's a box that says sign up and save, put your email in there, we'll only send you one a week. Most times, once in a great while, we might do two, but it's usually every Friday, you're just going to get one email from us. So uh, uh, well worth, you know, the, the effort to, to receive that every week. And it's the new arrivals. It can be information. Uh, you know, we'll definitely keep you uh, up to speed of what's going on in the hobby. Okay. Uh, new. Let's go right to new. Auto Art. Bunch of new, uh, new releases. GT Spirit. Auto. Spark. Look smart, TSM, Neo, Matrix. If you're a 43rd guy, make sure you're uh, hitting that up. On the left-hand side of our homepage, look for new arrivals. It's sorted by date, sorted by scale, easy to get right where you want to be. Uh, 18th, guys, I think I counted uh, over 20 new releases. And for you, uh, if you're a 112th guy, uh, Ferrari 365 GTB4 by GT Spirit. Very limited edition. Uh, we've got good stock right now, but you know the, the deal with 12 scales, they only come along, it seems like every, one, every so often we get a, a few new releases and this is gonna be a good one for sure. Uh, and anytime you wanna see uh, our, our current offerings, uh, we still got some good stock on some of the other 112 scale GT Spirit. Left hand side, uh, buy brands, just go to GT Spirit. And again, it's buy scale, so you can see just the 112 offerings we have. I did grab a few uh, of the, the new arrivals, but um, if you do the Le Mans miniatures uh, figurines, this is uh, two brand new James Hunt. Uh, so if you do, you know, garage scenes, dioramas, these are great pieces. 
Uh, one is he's signing a uh, autograph. One is he's carrying his helmet. Uh, but we got restock on a bunch of the codes that we were sold out on. Uh, I think there was seven or eight. So again, if you go to the, the brands uh, by uh, A through D, E through J, uh, go to Le Mans Miniatures or down in the lower part of the, the uh, homepage we have accessories and there is a, a category just for figurines. Great pieces and uh, again if you do the, the garage scenes these, these you don't get any better than that. Okay, 43rd scale guys. 70 Dodge Challenger uh, RT 426 Hemi by Spark. You know, if you do the street, 43rd Street cars, yeah, you know, they, they don't come along as, as often as the race cars, but really cool piece. This is going to be a new 143rd this week. And then if you do the 2016 uh, Le Mans cars, these are the, uh, the Audis, and this is the third and fourth place finishers. These are also in new 143rd this week. And I know, are most of you sitting down? The Spark 2017 calendar, cal calendar, catalog is here. <laughs> I got a calendar on my brain. Um, we only got 50 in this first shipment. So again, uh, club members are getting first dibs on this. I know a bunch of you have already uh, pre-ordered it. But uh, if you haven't, get this is going to be in the new miscellaneous category, 2017. They had it, they had it at Toy Fair in February, but it takes them until May to get it to us. <laughs> Go figure. Okay, um, one other. I didn't grab one. In the miscellaneous, any of you guys that do turntables, you know, for your displays, we've got our own line of turntables that we are manufacturing. Uh, there's basically two sizes. The smaller one can be run by batteries or AC adapter. The larger one is AC only. But these things absolutely blow away the uh, auto art turntables. Uh, the small one will turn, I think, up to 15 pounds. The larger one will turn 30 to 35 pounds. So again, uh, not only for models. If you've got a, you know, a, a crazy display and you want something to, to uh, rotate, uh, by all means, check these out. And I will be doing, uh, we're going to be doing some video just on the turntables, different applications. You know, we sell these things to bakeries, jewelry stores. Uh, uh, they're, they're very popular with trade shows. So again, check those out in the new miscellaneous category for this week. Okay, uh, Indy. I'm going. I'm going to rifle through these quick. But the the four on the lower tier I got behind me here. Seventy Johnny Lightning PJ Cole winner. Race day Marmon Was 1911 winner. Paxton Turbine 1967 Pernelli Jones, and the new one is the Joe Leonard. Uh, 1971 PJ Colt USAC championship car. Those are all coming in a shipment that's on the way. It's going to be here next week. And basically those are the final, I think, 48 pieces on the three that are restocks. And the Joe Leonard, very low run, 300 pieces. Uh, these are all in. If you go to our Indy 118th category, upper left, look for replicas exclusives sorted by scale go to 118th Indy you can see all of these the current in stock you can also see all of our future releases the 85 spin and win is in there uh, the other one that we just cut the PO on is the Smoky Unix sidecar that one is going to be going into production here very soon uh, so we're going to be rocking and rolling here as we as we get into the summer uh, we're hoping to land a model like every four five six weeks uh, so again hit that category up get those pre-orders in and uh, I got I to gotta throw it in here right now. Uh, and I know I can speak for Brian and myself. Huge thank you to all of you guys that support our indie program. And, you know, I get emails all the time. Thank you guys for producing in these indie cars. No, we, we want to thank you because without the support of our great customers like you guys, none of this would ever be possible. And, uh, you know, it's just a, it's a, it's a, something that we wanted to do for a lot of years. And uh, thanks to our great customer base, it's a... It's, uh, you know, it's finally happening, and from what we're hearing, you know, you guys are, are really liking the quality. Uh, we're extremely uh, happy with the, the three factories we're working with. So going forward, guys, lots of good stuff in the pipeline. And, and i got to throw this out there. I don't know what. The last two weeks, ton of questions on Novi's. Well, let me put it to rest right now. Yes, we are going to do Novi's. Uh, I know there's a bunch of great cars in there. 
They're not going to happen anytime soon. We're probably talking sometime 2018. Our schedule, I know this sounds crazy, but our schedule for this year is almost filled up. So, yes, we're going to do Novi's and, again, long, long list of cars. Uh, this is long term for us. We're not, we're not doing the one and done. But uh, in our next round of announcements, I don't know how soon that's going to happen. There is going to be some Novi's in there, so stay tuned on that one. Okay. Um, eBay. I didn't grab any, but I was sifting through the listings. Right now, in our rare and hard to find category alone, there's 123 auctions running. Keep in mind, all of our auctions start at just 99 cents and fixed price items. We accept reasonable offers. Uh, go to the homepage at replicars.com. Right in the middle of the page, you'll see the eBay icon. And keep in mind, we buy collections. One model to 1,000, it doesn't matter. No collection is too small or too big. We have a, an autoresponder form that we can send you back that explains the whole process. We have a trade-in program. If you want to trade in some of your older models to keep up with the newer releases, we can do that too. We're wheeling and dealing. Uh, nothing is off the table or out of the question. Uh, you can contact Brian directly, B-R-I-A-N at replicars.com. Contact me, Mark, at replicars.com. Or you can call us, 802-747-7151. Uh, well worth your time to cruise those eBay listings. Uh, a couple that are up there right now. 43rd scale, guys. I mean, a ton of... One I was checking out, uh, 1970 Mini Champs Yoke and Rent World Champion car. It's still at 99 cents. It's been sitting there for three days. Okay? This is, a, you know, can go low, can go high. Uh, there's also a bunch of the uh, Quartzo uh, Porsche 956 versions. There's Senna Collection up there. 43rd scale guys right now it's it's uh, it's a great time to cruise those those uh, eBay listings uh, 18th scale guys one I was checking out mini champs 94 Sauber Andre de Cesaris uh, 200th Grand Prix from Canada I was there they painted the car special to a big 200 down the side very cool paint scheme we got one of those up for grabs right now drag guys the Harry Hurst Oles twin engine dragster we got one of those up for grabs. Um, Exoto, there is two, I think, two or three of the Ferrari 500 F2 versions up there right now. So again, well worth your time. Check out those eBay listings. Uh, anytime you have questions, by all means, just contact us. Uh, glad to help any way we can. All right, hot topic this week. And I, I don't know why, again, I've been getting this question a lot lately. 43rd scale, uh, tobacco marked cars, okay, actual livery. Why does Spark include the decals and Mini Champs doesn't? Well, that's a really good question and one I don't have an answer to. Um, it's just something that, you know, I think Spark has a, I'm going to say a set, okay, and they are, are kind of pressing the issue and they're, you know, testing the waters, I'm going to say. And uh, Mini Champs, I think uh, over the years, they, they probably got spanked a few times by the tobacco police, as we all have. Uh, but it's just one of those things that, you know, I had a, a customer ask me about, uh, there was some Lotus 72 versions, I think we got in new last week or the week before, and he said, you know, I'd buy this if it comes with the decals. Well, I went down and checked, no decals. Uh, that same car by Spark, by all means, has the JPS markings, and, and for you guys that don't know, anytime you buy a Spark model that should have decals, they're always taped to the bottom of the base, inside the packaging, they're not visible, Probably for good reason, huh? <laughs> okay, so I wish I had an answer to that question, guys, but I don't. Okay, it's just it's one of those things. Gray area. A gray area in the hobby, I'm going to call it. Okay, uh, I think we're down to the shout-outs. Our newest Buyers Club member, Leland Thomas. He's in La Mirada, California. Uh, placed his first order yesterday, and he joined the club Welcome to the family, Leland. Uh, we appreciate the business. Uh, Rob Smith, out in Brownsburg, Indiana. He's our newest Indy customer. He purchased the 74 AJ Foyt pole winner, a great car that we're still, you know, we still got good stock. We chip away. We sell them every day. But uh, Rob, thank you so much. Welcome to the Replicars family. Uh, Rod Rothacher. I hope I'm saying that right, Rod. Burbank, California. Uh, customer, you know, years ago, his last order with us was 2008. 
we had our 15% off sale, boom, Rod places an order. So I guess 15% is the number that will, you know, prompt customers to, uh, to make a purchase. So Rod, thank you. We appreciate the business. Welcome back. And uh, I, I throw this out there all the time. Any of you, uh, you know, club members that are, that are uh, you know, I wore my club shirt last week. By all means, shoot me an email or, or give us a call. In your next order, we'll gladly throw in an updated welcome kit. You know, that's just something that we do. And, and sure, we want you guys wearing those T-shirts because <laughs> that's, our, that's PR for us, you know. And uh, we're going to send you a mug. We got the whole kit. Um, so I, I had an email from Doug Burris, longtime uh, supporter, uh, club member, and said, hey, you know, can I get an updated shirt like the one you had on? I said, sure, we'll, we'll ship it right out to you. So, uh, uh, Doug, thank you. Good to hear from you, and I uh, hope, hope you enjoy that new, uh, that new uh, swag bag we sent out to you. Um, and our, our uh, dealer shout-out this week, brand-new customer, Yasser Helmi, and he's uh, Golden Lion Tech in Saudi Arabia. Okay, this just tells you we ship worldwide every single day, and uh, these guys found us online. Uh, they've, been, they've been really uh, strong supporters in the, in the first month they've been with us. So, yeah, sir, thank you so much. We appreciate the business, and you know anytime I can help, you know where I am. Uh, okay, I think, oh, the club. I didn't get the club a plug, okay? Yeah, I just mentioned the swag bag. $29.95 a year. We're going to send you the swag bag. T-shirt, mug, pens, keychain. We got a flash drive. We got golf tees. Yeah, 30 bucks. all that's worth it. But you get 10% off. Every purchase, doesn't matter, in stock, back order, pre-order. Every week, you get an email directly from me that only goes to club members. It could be special offerings. It can be a special discount. We can have sales for members when the regular, you know, the general public is not having a sale. It could be free shipping. Well worth the investment. If you have any questions about the club, by all means, contact me. Uh, but I had, you know, a, a customer that buys all of our indie cars, and he asked me, you know, what's the deal with the club? I'm like, well, if you're buying our indie cars, you know, you're you're pretty much paying for it on one purchase. You're going to pay for the pay for the cost of it. We're going to send you the replica swag bag, and the rest of the year you're saving on every model we ship you. So, you know, it's uh, I'm going to say it's right up there with the no-brainers. Okay. Any questions? Again, hit me up on the homepage at replicars.com. On the left, look for join our club. Again, great investment, great family we got going. So. I'm leaving it at that. Okay. I think that's it. I think that's it. I think it's a wrap. Okay. I hope everybody has a great weekend. I'll see you all next week.